here's what happens. We're supposed to be lights. But if I got dirt all over my bulb, <laughs> now see, I got a light in me. I'm born again, but it's not helping anybody else because I'm all caked over with all this junk from the world that I hang out in all the time. And this doesn't help anybody or affect anybody. And even if I kind of ramp it up as high as I think I can get it, Man, I'm not only going to church once a week now, I'm going twice a week and I sing in the choir and I'm an usher, a greeter at the door. Woo! Look at me. <laughs> Christian, Christian. <laughs> and I've got a bumper sticker and a pair of cross earrings and all of Joyce's books. <laughs> so what? I'm going to try real hard. <laughs> eh, I'm going to try real hard. But what happens if you invite the fire of God into your life? <laughs> and you know, it, it starts out a little a little fire, a little more light. A little more fire, a little more light. A little more fire, a little more light. Oh my God, I don't think I can take any more. A little more light, fire, a little more light. A little more fire, a little more light. A little more fire, a little more light. Wow, all of a sudden, I've been affecting people and people's lives around me are changing.